Iran's Ministry of Defense unveiled a nine-day defense missile. This defense missile will be installed in the form of eight canisters on the Sevim Kordat system. The Sevim Kordat system is the same system that targeted the American Advanced Global Hawk drone in late 2019. But the new missile of this system is the nine-day missile, which has significant features. The new missile is designed to counter bombs, cruise missiles, and suicide drones. Given that the main threat today is the attack with a large number of drones and cruise missiles. This missile will be placed on the Sevim of Kordat system in eight numbers and can deal with this threat by increasing the number of missiles. The specifications of this missile are such that its length is 4 meters and it weighs 250 kilograms and has a range of 30 kilometers. The type of guidance of this missile is semi-active radar, which means that it is guided by the ground radar of the missile, and this reduces the weight of the missile. Probably, like the previous Sevim Kordat missile called Tater, which is the Iranian example of Russia's Pook missile, this missile will also become an optical type. When we look at the military purchases of the rich Arab countries of southern Iran, we see a large number of bombs and cruise missiles. The 9-day missile is Iran's proposed way to deal with the high number of guided bombs and cruise missiles. Iran also unveiled a new radar for the Sevim of Kordat system, which is called Quds. The Quds radar is derived from the Russian Vostok radar that previously identified the RQ-170 stealth drone. This simultaneous radar detects 120 targets and has a range of up to 400 kilometers, which with this ability practically completes the way to deal with a large number of targets. Iran is expected to use this air defense system in its military ships, such as the Shahid Soleimani ship, and to provide good air cover for the ships due to the low weight of the missiles and the high number of missiles. The important point of all these systems and the new radar is that they are all mobile, which makes it difficult to identify and target, and it is also stated that this radar reaches the operating conditions in only 6 minutes. In the specifications of this system, the number 32 is stated for simultaneous engagement, which due to the higher number, can generally target up to 96 vehicles, which is a high number. Another point of this system is being on the same system as before, which reduces costs and simplicity in use. In the end, it should be said that the new unveiling of the Iranian Revolutionary Guard Corps in the field of air defense system to deal with drones, guided bombs and cruise missiles is very valuable and can even make the Sevim of Kordad system a good weapon for sale in the world market.